Hello friends, so today I am extremely honored to introduce you to Dr. Ranjan Kumar Sahu who has scored rank 2 in the May AIMS 2019 exam. Dr. Ranjan was our exclusive classroom student at the foundation batch at Bhuvneshwar Center. Heartiest congratulations Dr. Ranjan. Thank you, thank you sir. So how does it feel to get rank 2 in the, the top institute of India AIMS? So currently I feel awesome. But when the result came, it was unbelievable for me. I cross-checked it twice, thrice with my mom. Each single digit, whether the number is matching or not. Okay, it was really, to honestly speaking, it was beyond my range of thought that I will be coming rank two in Ames. No, but I was expecting a good rank from you when yes. we were talking before the result, and you were constantly telling, "No, sir, my paper did not went well." But the way that you gave me the questions and the answered on my group I was very sure that you will be getting so I, I don't know whether you were expecting it or, or not but I was definitely expecting so, that uh, you will yeah. be getting so that's why you are a teacher rank. sir I am a student <laughs> okay, okay. but uh, I, I will say sir uh, after my PGI results I was completely relaxed and uh, both AIMS counseling and PGI uh, PGI counseling and AIMS exam was on the same day the mm. first day publicity so I didn't study much I was uh, relaxed yeah okay but uh, since I, see, I was pretty much relaxed, maybe the paper went good because... Yeah, of so the, once you are stress-free, hmm. you are always giving the paper uh, in a much, much better environment. So Ranjan, you joined us when you were in a third year MBBA. So uh, can you just tell us your journey with us in DBMCI and not just the journey in DBMCI. Now I want this interview to be focused on that a student who is starting the preparation in a third year MBBS, how he should go about the preparation. Yeah, basically, uh, as every medical student, first year and second year I was for chill, chilling out and I did the same thing, okay, but I was sincere in my classes, okay, but not oriented to like going for coaching PG. From third year itself, like my seniors, they used to join, so I also thought, okay, this is a, as per my seniors advice, I also started, jo I uh, joined DBMCI Bhubaneswar. It was the first batch uh, in Bhubaneswar, I was quite skeptical whether it will work or not work, whether I will get the kind of support required. But uh, I will say that was the best ever decision I have taken. The kind of atmosphere, there's, there's a small classroom, there's a live face-to-face -face discussion, we could ask our doubt. It was a very good decision that I have taken. Then from third year itself, I completed almost uh, 12 subjects. I completed in the third year itself, okay. I made all the notes. I couldn't make uh, six to seven notes because uh, in our institute they are quite strict about attendance and uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, that's what uh, was the uh, plan for third year. Itself. Yeah, I feel reading the 12 subjects in a third year is itself a very, very big deal. Sure. Okay, I mean uh, that I d even I do not expect that uh, all the 19 subjects can be covered in just one, hour, one year. So even if you are done with the 12 subjects, I think uh, the foundation has already been laid down. Yeah, uh, that actually you revise your first year, second year subject once more yeah. in your third year. Exactly, and you have to you, do that. You know the direction to go for your final year. You know what I have to study in my final year, what is important, what is not important, what should be my basic knowledge. So it helps in your final year exam a lot. Okay, so um, one thing is uh, Dr. Ranjan, you attended the classes, you were regular with the classes. But uh, uh, what else that you used to do at that point of time, like let us say you have attended a class and see the, the biggest advantage I feel is the starting early is that you have plenty of time. Yeah. A student who is starting late with us in a TND or a regular batch for one year, they have just one year or nine or ten months. But person who is coming to us for a three year, I feel that they can read the subject at length. Okay, so what you used to do to supplement your preparation of uh, after attending the class, let's say a student who is a third year MBBS who is with us right now, uh, he is watching this particular interview and he wants to see what Dr. Ranjan did uh, after attending the class so to enhance the knowledge. Yeah, you see uh, the thing is once you start attending from your third year, what will happen, you start to know actually what is anatomy, actually what is pathology, what are the implications of it in your year. You then you get an interest, okay. That interest was lacking in me in first year and second year. When I attended the things, when I came to know, okay, this is the thing why we are studying anatomy, this is the thing why we are studying physiology, 
then uh, interest was generated. After that, I was quite focused on my studies. Then I started reading standard textbooks. I used to go to my college, attend. I will say that going to a college and attending all the clinical posting is utmost important if you want to get into any central institute. I totally okay. agree. So that is very much important. And uh, you know, keep on that referring to your notes. You get the standard thing like you don't have to read the guidelines. You don't have to read 10 books together. You will be confused. You stick to one notes, read your standard textbooks. In case any doubt, discrepancy, always you can refer for guidelines. But yeah, it, the notes makes it much easier for you. Okay, it gives you a direction in which you will go. And third year onwards, if you are uh, uh, reading that subject, you will be like you, third year you have completed once you have heard about the subject in your third year. So final year you will be taught in your college. You hear it in your college. That's the second revision. Then you will prepare. You will study yourself. You will study your notes. That's the th third revision. Before exam, you will study your notes once more. Fourth time you are reading the same topic. Again, before your PG entrance, you will be reading it. So without so giving much revisions. effort for revision, you are not giving an extra effort for revision. It's like you are studying as usual, but mm. it becomes a revision. So mm. basically because you are starting early, early, you have a much stronger grasp on that particular mm. subject. Uh, Dr. Ranjan, how important it is to have a study partner during the preparation time. What is your take? Because a lot of times students ask me, they say that they are reading, but they are distracting, they are distracted, and um, uh, they are not able to focus onto the thing. They have read it, but they are not able to recall it. So what is a take of a rank two aims about, uh, about this? So uh, I will say, OK, it's not a. Uh, uh, I mean, every student is different. Yeah. I will not you say that have, all students are same. Some but students are happy reading alone. They perform better, they retain better if they study alone. Some students, when they discuss things, they retain better. Like for me, example for me, I require someone to be with me so that I will, you know, I can't study beyond one hour. So I need someone, after yeah. one hour, if I get up, someone to with me sit down, we'll complete this topic. Yeah. So if you have a study partner, you discuss things, you have doubt, you can clear it from your friend. Yeah. He or she has doubt, she can clear it from me. So, and I was lucky to have a good study partner in that aspect. Yeah. And, uh, so that acted as a win-win situation for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, so nice. Um, um, Dr. Ranjan, uh, so you have made your foundation with this. And uh, then uh, what, what else that you did? Because nowadays we know that the patterns are changing. And one thing that you very rightly said is that specifically if you're targeting the Central Institute, your concept should be very clear and more important than that, you should attend your postings pretty that's regularly. That's that's because now specifically in the AIMS, the pattern has been changed and they are more oriented toward the clinical based questions. Um, and specifically the images uh, mm -hmm. that, that you are getting. So what else uh, See, that, the that you did? AIMS people, I think means as per me, whatever I, I saw through all the papers, AIMS is one of the exam where they put a lot of effort in making the question. The teachers, I think they put effort in making the question. They know what are the students of India doing right now. Okay. They know that students are missing clinical classes. They know students are bunking intensive, which is not yeah. a good thing to do. Exactly. Okay. So they target those areas. Okay. I am lucky. Emergency. Yeah. yeah. I am lucky that I I belong to AIMS Bhubaneswar where we have a very good schedule, we have a tight internship, even though I didn't like that thing during that thing. But yeah, today I'm reaping the results of that. At that time, it. you yeah. feel that okay, your time is getting wasted, wasted, where other people are able to read. Uh, yeah, but I today I'm reaping the results of those hard work and those clinical postings that I did. So I will say, go to your college, go to your clinical postings, then study your notes. Okay, all right. Uh, so, uh, and what extra that you did for the images? Images, uh, during uh, like my time, I came to know that nowadays the uh, focus on image is there. So I used to study Robbins. Okay, I like Robbins a lot. Okay, so that time I was focused on Robbins. But uh, third year itself, I think uh, from fourth year, I think uh, there was a vibe session. I had attended vibe once in fourth year and I had attended vibe once in fifth year. Okay, okay. vibe is like, yeah, during during, uh, okay. by, uh, vibe You attended vibe twice? Yeah, twice. Okay, okay. because you know the things change a lot in yeah. one, two years. Yeah. Okay. And vibe is a kind of thing, you know, it's not only based on image, you know, you cover all 19 subjects and they uh, they focus on the important topics as usual. It's not only image based, there is also, they do cover 
bit of theory about this subject. So that helps in the overall revision at the time. Okay. Um, one more thing that Dr. Ranjan, I want to ask you is now about the role of the coaching that see, now see the competition is getting tougher. So there are students who can read on their own and we know that uh, uh, ultimately self-reading is also an important part. And but uh, I feel that one of an important way of selecting the the institute as as your uh, favorite or the primary institute is about uh, the kind of uh, support that you get uh, from the the in charge over there. So what was your experience about DBMCI Bhuvneshwar Center about Dr. Ravi Kant who handles the center over there? I'll say uh, as I mentioned, okay, I was very much in in doubt whether I'll get the kind of thing I require, okay. But I'll say the classes were very good over there. You know, when you have a class of 100 students only sitting together with talking with the faculty, you ask questions, faculty asks you back questions. That interaction is there. During the break hours, you go to the teacher. I remember I went there, Ashwini sir, and uh, asked about how to go about this thing. Should I be very, very much serious for my PG or just focus on my final year subject? So those things help a lot, okay. You get, you get the confidence that Okay, uh, I am under someone's mentorship. I am under someone's guidance. People, it's not like they do care about me. They want me to be selected. So that it was a very good experience in uh, Bhuvneshwar. Uh, and as also, sir always wanted like results. Okay, you do well, whatever be it. You want extra classes, it will be given. You want to attend satellite classes, it will be given. You want to give tests, n number of tests, it will be given. But at the end, I want you to be successful. I want you to be happy. And that's what yeah, I that's, you are that's what it making happened. making your parents proud uh, getting ranked too. Um, Dr. Ranjan, two, three more questions. Uh, one is that uh, uh, we often we get this particular doubt from the students that AIMS uh, top 10 ranks are for AIMS New Delhi students. Um, and uh, so the, the students who are from AIMS New Delhi, they are the one that who get the ranks in the top 10. So was that doubt that came to your mind ever and that whether you will be able to achieve the task or uh, what is your message to the student who have this dream in the mind that they can do it, they want to do it, but the other thing that is coming to their mind is that they might not be able to do it. So what is your message to those students? See, preparation is same for everyone. The content is same for everyone. Brain is same for everyone. Brain, the, <laughs> the, 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 the capacity is same brain. for everyone. Yes. Okay. There is not much of difference between you, me, or a guy from Ames, Delhi. It is the hard work, the smart work, and proper direction, which is important. That makes the difference. Okay. At the end, when you are sitting for those three hours, those three hours matters. Whoever you are, how much ever you are prepared, from which institute you are, you are from Ames Daily, you are from a very low college in a, some private college, nothing matters. If you have worked hard, you will get the results. And yeah. you can see, you can see the results. Okay, yeah. now it's not only Ames Daily in top 10. Yeah. So this is the message that I want to give you to the students that it does not matter from where you have done the MBBS. If you are determined to achieve the things, definitely the success will be yours. The result is in front of you, rank two, and not just rank two, has scored brilliant results in almost every exam that, that he has wrote. Uh, and uh, so uh, just thinking from that you are from a remote college or from a so-called a peripheral college which is not so popular and then you will not be able to achieve this task that is not going to happen we know that the rank one need is again uh, not from the a delhi college or a mumbai college if you are from that college yes definitely that doesn't mean that you will not be able to score so college does not matter it is about a student it is about the way that you are preparing the result is in front of you need a right guidance uh, if the guidance and your hard work matches i can bet on this that the success will definitely be yours um, any any specific advices that you want to give to your juniors dr ranjan uh, advices i will say the things what wrong i have done okay yeah so yeah that, i probably that, that that's is a very more good important thing. i don't yeah. want my juniors or my friends to repeat those things okay first first thing is i couldn't attend all the classes, I left six to seven classes in Bhatia because of tight schedule and my lack of uh, means I didn't give that much focus during that time. I went off track in between a little bit. So what happened during my preparation, I had to struggle a lot. Okay, getting the right thing, getting confused. So that was a bit a problematic situation for me. Okay, I had to re refer to three books 
So I will say that don't miss your classes. Make your notes when you are having time. Make it complete so that in future you don't have any problem. Second thing is, don't see here and there. Don't uh, see on other resources. Yeah. Don't uh, focus on what others are doing. Yeah. Focus on your strength. You know what are your strength. You know what are your weaknesses. Focus on that. Don't see like that guy is doing that. I should do that. No. It's what you can do. See your strength. Like I am pretty slow in my studies. I won't be able to complete the whole notes at a time. But I know that even if I want also, I can't complete. Even if I try to follow the other person also, I won't yeah, be able to complete. So I know that, okay, if I'm going slow, I'll first catch out upon the most important topics. So that if I leave something, I leave the less important topics. So you need to believe, you need to focus on yourself. And third thing is, believe in yourself. Okay, you can do it. I was not believing, but me, the hard work, okay, and my teachers believe that you can do it. Work for it. But you yeah. see, if you are having a good confidence, I, I felt it because after PGA exam, I had I gained that confidence that I am also one of the toppers, so I can do it. Okay, so that might be a factor for such a great success in AMC. Yeah. Did you attend any live classroom coaching apart from DBMCI? Uh, apart from DBMCI, like uh, I didn't attend any other live classes, but uh, after uh, my internship, uh, I had to attend the test and discussion series, but uh, uh, unfortunately in my place, uh, AIMS TND is not available by the Bhatia. So I had to join DAMS TND over there. And at the same time during internship, like uh, we didn't have uh, the question bank available during that time only. Uh, so Maro was available, I took Maro to solve the questions during the internship and whenever I get free, I will take up a module and solve it. So these two are uh, the other resources that I used during the during that phase. Okay. But otherwise, as far as the foundation course and the live classes are concerned, you yeah. were associated yeah, with yeah, I, I was yeah. completely with uh, Dr. Bhatia from third year itself. Okay. All right. Um, what about the new pattern, the, the new pattern that came in this year? So how you were able to cope up with this particular new pattern? See, uh, when I, just, I was actually very much, uh, I felt it very funny when people, the new pattern came, people panicked like anything. I was like, why are they panicking? They are asking the same question. They are serving the same vegetables in a different menu. Okay, they are just changing the pattern. If you are, if you know the steps of inflammation, however it is given, you will be able to solve it. Okay, there is nothing to panic in that. The, you have an added advantage. They, I knew that, okay, they are giving the new pattern question. This time the questions won't be tough. It will be relatively easier, the new pattern. So that was an advantage for me. And I know that if I am able to focus on those, those things, I'll be in top, you think, because many people will pa are panicking about the thing to attempt, not to attempt. So during the paper, I was sure I will start with those 150, the, the new pattern question. I completed those 150 new pattern questions first, and then I went on to those 150 single based question. And it really helped because uh, my friends like gave exam on fifth, so they had that input that we the questions are very easy on new pattern question, but we were not able to, we didn't get enough time to complete it. So I made the, immediately made my strategy, no, I will start with new pattern. I'll start from 151, complete it, and then I'll go to single best answer, and that helped actually. Okay, all right. Um, okay, so uh, so this is, see, the, the pattern is pattern. It doesn't doesn't matter much. If your knowledge is, is right up to, up with you, I am sure that you will achieve the success. Uh, big congratulations once again, Dr. Ranjan, and may you achieve all the success in your life, uh, DBMCI is always available with you and uh, may you keep guiding your juniors so that they are also sitting here and giving the interviews and guiding their juniors for yeah, them. Yeah, actually I will thank them a lot. Okay, first of all, I will thank my parents. Okay, my parents, my brother, sister, Jiju, Bhavi, like they were very much, I never, I had such a supportive family, they never put pressure on me that you have to do PG. Okay, they were happy with my MBBS. Okay, okay. <laughs> they, they never put a, you have to do PG in this. Even today, I don't have to ask them. Okay, they said, whatever you like. Yeah. Okay, you want to chill, you want to take radio and chill in your life. They said to me, you take radio and chill in your life. Okay, I was like, <laughs> no, I am interested in medicine. I <laughs> want the tough part. Okay. You're talking to a radiologist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, yeah, that kind of supportive family have and my yeah. juniors. Okay, I actually, it's because of them. I teach them. I like teaching. In my clinical posting, so I see, this teach, is what I, I keep on saying the class 
that teaching has a retention power of more than 95 percent yeah yeah absolutely you yeah. you test yourself yeah. when you teach someone you are testing yourself yeah you, you generate doubt in your own mind yeah. okay these are the things they ask you back questions so that helps a lot okay so the juniors okay I will thank Ankit Tiwari, my friends, okay, Hudeshwar, Sachin, Sambit, they were my flatmates, we used to stay together. Okay. Okay, and most importantly, my best friend, Rakri, okay, she, so she put in a lot of effort so that I could uh, uh, study, uh, keep on motivating. Was she a study partner too? <laughs> <laughs> See, uh, she is doing medicine in PGI. Okay, right wow, now. great. And you are also joining PGI? Yeah, probably I'll be joining there. Great, okay, okay. So all the best uh, for all your endeavors that you do. A big congratulations. Thank you, thank you, thank you.